Thank you all for coming to our fifth annual Fundraising Concert. I hope you will enjoy the program. Uh, my name is Agatha Chin. I'm a member of um, WRCM. Our founder, Tammy. Tammy, could you wave your hand? rather challenging for them to come to all the practice and uh, also the performance. We are all very proud of you guys and let's give a big hand to our kids. We will also like to uh, send our appreciation to our wonderful supporters. Your generous donation enabled us to reach out to the children in that need help in different parts of the world. We list some of your names on the program, but the actual list goes on and on. So, ladies and gentlemen, let's give our supporter a big round of applause. It is extremely important for our kids to participate in, in this kind of events. That will show them to show their caring to the others. We really appreciate the partnership and the support of World Vision. Ladies and gentlemen, I would like to introduce you, Mr. Santos, our dear friend and wonderful supporter from World Vision. special requests for some of the students to come during the year to form in front of all of our staff. And the responses that uh, I have received back from the president's office, from our vice presidents, and from the staff is that they are just truly amazed. In fact, they actually look forward to members of the chamber to come back during the year to perform their music and to show their talents. And the compliments that I received in my emails uh, about Maya and her dancing uh, performance was just outstanding. They were just astounded with the tremendous talent. Uh, it's coming very evident that you're outgrowing our facility. And uh, because of that, uh, World Vision International, this is the headquarters for World Vision, in which we uh, manage our work in over 100 countries around the world. And this year we are celebrating our 60th year of reaching out to the poor around the world in emergency relief and also development work to raise up the quality of life to the poor around the world. And we couldn't do this without the support and the collab collaboration from people like yourselves, and especially through the hard work and talents of these young people here. My role at World Vision, I'm a national manager for church relations. I work with churches across the United States. So one would ask, well, what do you, why are you then so focused in partnering with a group like this, a group of young people? Because ladies and gentlemen, this is the future. This is the future. And what you are instilling in your young people is not only supporting them with their interests and developing their music talent and interests, you are also developing their passion, their heart, their caring for the poor. And for that, we are highly grateful. And we want to encourage all you young people to continue in your growth and development is to always remember ways that you can care and remember the poor around the world. Remember, the least, the last, and the lost of us. 
And those are three words that I learned as a very young boy from my parents who were the good role models who taught me that no matter the hardships that I faced growing up in a poor family, my parents always reminded me that there will always be people who are less fortunate, who do face struggles worse than our own. And we must always remember to keep the poor in our minds and our hearts and seek always ways that we can reach out and care. And for that, I want to thank you. I also want to give a special acknowledgement to, uh, again, Tammy Wang, who's been my partner in uh, putting on these events over the past years. There are a number of people here at the headquarters of World Vision who are behind the scenes, who I meet with, who plan to help put this event together. One of my colleagues, Katrina, she's been walking around here, helping out here. She's here today. I want to thank also Agatha Chin, Monica Chan, Marge Wang, Vicky Chow Me, and um, Jill Yu, who just does just a fantastic job. I'm always amazed sitting in the back during the rehearsals and during the performance to see just the hard dedication and the knowledge of Jill and her ability to bring all these individual musicians into one group to bring out this beautiful music for us today. I also want to thank uh, Johnny Thompson Music for their help and with instruments and support and especially on behalf of World Vision, I want to extend to all of you, thank you very much. All of you did a great job. And since I've been here with the group for four years, I've actually seen some of these young people grow up. And I see some younger ones, newer ones, coming into the group, but the group is getting bigger. So uh, I was mentioning the time that we have to think about how we can take this wonderful talent to larger, maybe a larger venue, so that others uh, in Los Angeles will be able to hear and appreciate the wonderful talents of music and the dancing performances that have been shown here today. Thank you very much. I want to wish you all a great, wonderful holiday season. And thank you for caring and giving to support our work to help the people in Chile who suffered tremendously. And I just want to say a quick comment that what we are doing in Chile, we've been in Chile for 30 years, and that earthquake destroyed, as you saw from some of the photos, a lot of infrastructure. Homes, bridges, roads, electronics, uh, systems, clinics, schools. A lot of those types of facilities that World Vision has been responsible for creating over the years. And now our challenge is to not only care for those to feed people who are affected, to keep them in safe places, but also to help rebuild their lives so that they can have a joyful, prosperous future for their children. And for your support, I want to say thank you, and God bless all of you.